Hello, thank you for watching this video. We have created two scenes. The first scene is over here. It's called main menu. And the main menu, there is your main menu right there. And the script for that is attached over here. This is the script. We've got arrow controls over here. This controls the arrow so it can move up and down. And we have the button click functions over here. So this is going to be for all the buttons that are on the screen. We also have the game object references over here. Then we have unity functions over here. These are standard unity functions. We go back and we're going to take a look at main camera. It has a starting resolution script, which is just going to set the resolution at the start. When so I hit play, the animations run, and these animations are also referenced inside one of the scripts, which I'll show you. So this is the arrow movement, and we can actually hit enter to to basically run the animations. And if I go to main menu over here, you'll see some of the references. These are the references to the animation control and the animations are inside the main menu game object. And you can see animators attached to most of them. The next screen is the versus screen which is also part of this game and part of the scene. The versus screen runs after the main menu. So after the main menu runs the versus screen runs and once it runs it's going to look like this so I'm going to stop it right here in the versus screen it just waits for a while and then loads the next scene so we've got an 8 second wait before the next scene is loaded so I'll be performing this task right now of loading the next scene Once you're over here, this is the scene. You can punch, you can kick, you can block, and you can do the special attack. You can jump as well. Okay. Let's take a look at this character. This is the character. If I open this, you'll see there's one script attached called General Parrot Controller. We also have physics setup using the rigid body. And this is the player controller. we have the states over here these are different states which will also be used for for the multiplayer then we have input functions over here this is for the various inputs that the player can provide we have player movement functions and a ray cast to check if the player is on the ground we have got animation animation references over here and we've got unity functions over here I'll play this. When we're not doing anything, we're in the idle state. When we're moving, we're in the move state. When we're kicking, we're in the kick state. Punching in the punch state, blocking in the block state, and using the special attack, we can do special attacks right here. When you're jumping, you can en not enter any other state. And I also have a test function, I believe, for the for the player being hurt. There it is. So you can also get days while you're jumping. And this is the days function. And this is, uh, I can go enter the day state when I press U. And this is just for testing. Thank you very much for watching this video.